everyone, it's Casey. So I'm just gonna use this video to be totally open and honest with you guys. I made a video about a month ago or three weeks ago, something like that, saying I was back to booktube and I was excited to be back and that was all very true in the moment. But then I didn't really come back, did I? I have been incredibly busy and a lot has been going on in my life. Text, why am I getting text messages? But another thing is, I haven't really been reading much at all. Booktube is incredible. I started over a year ago. It's been amazing, seriously. It's been such an incredible outlet to talk about books, to meet such cool people, and to talk to the most amazing people, which is really the thing that makes me the most sad. Like, the reason I'm the most sad that I've been gone from Booktube is not even the books, it's the people. Like, I don't ever want to lose you guys. I don't want you guys to ever be out of my life, which is why I continue to make videos. Obviously, I continue for the books as well, but I really continue for the people, and I feel guilty because I haven't been supporting you guys. I haven't been watching videos or commenting on videos lately. I'm kind of an all or nothing person. Like, if I decide to start eating healthy, I'm either going to eat so healthy it's not even funny, or I'm going to just, like, not care about what I eat at all. I don't you know what I mean? I'm all or nothing. There's no in-between, and that's kind of how I am with booktube, and I feel bad about that, but I get overwhelmed. I get overwhelmed with how many videos I need to watch and comment on, and I, and it's, when I say that, it almost makes it sound like it's a chore. It's not a chore at all. I highly enjoy watching my friends' videos. They make incredible content. I highly enjoy it. I watched booktube for years before I ever made videos. So I'm not watching and commenting to get people to watch and comment on my videos. I'm watching out of pure joy. Like, I had watched for years prior before I made my channel. Like, that's why I made my channel, is I enjoyed watching booktube so incredibly much. So I'm not saying that. Um, I, I don't want you guys to ever think that watching your videos is some kind of chore for me. But it does get overwhelming. I have a lot of people I want to watch and not very much time. And I don't want to just watch like two people and not everyone. So I'm just like I said, I'm all or nothing. And I'm also kind of becoming all or nothing when it comes to reading, which is sad because reading is a hobby. That's all it is. It's a hobby. It's so much fun. I love it. And I've been an avid reader for like the last 10 years. I've been reading at least like 50 books a year for the last 10 years. But when I started booktube, it became a little bit overwhelming. And um, for the last like few months, I haven't been reading much at all. And I kind of did need a break. I was going through a lot um, of stuff and I needed a break from reading, but like I said, I'm the all or nothing kind of person. I either want to read like 10 books a month or I get too overwhelmed and just don't want to read at all. Which is terrible. And I never felt that way before booktube, but I feel like with booktube, you want to read in order to make videos about books. Like, the way I make videos is through reading. So, um, whether it's like a wrap up or a review or even a tag, like you need to be reading books to do those things. And I haven't been. I haven't been reading a lot of books. Do I miss reading? Absolutely. Do I love reading? More than anything. And I really do need to get back into it. I need to jump back in and I am planning to. Life happens. Life got crazy. And it's funny because for the last year I've been doing booktube, I never felt overwhelmed by it. I kept a pretty good schedule and never felt overwhelmed by it but it's when you leave and you have to come back that it feels overwhelming. It was because I was forced, my health forced me to leave booktube for a while, for a pretty long while, like three weeks or something, which doesn't sound long, but for me it is because I was putting up like two or three videos a week. So when you leave for about three weeks, it's intimidating to come back and it does seem difficult. And I know I'm sounding, this whole thing sounds dramatic. Like booktube is not the end all be all of my life. Like it is very important to me, but I don't want this to sound like some kind of horrible pity party. I don't know what to do. No, no, like booktube is supposed to be enjoyable. It's not supposed to be this horrible, hard thing. Like it's supposed to be fun and enjoyable and it is fun and enjoyable. It still is. I love it. I feel Feel like when I start to watch everyone's videos again, I will get more motivated to read. And then when I read, I will get more motivated to make videos. It's a, it's a cycle. Like, it, it goes like that. The more booktube videos I watch, the more I want to read. And the more I read, the more I want to make videos. So, um, 
I will get back into it. I'm going to really, really try my best. I have not lost my passion for this channel. I have not lost my love for any of you. I think about you guys all the time, just in everyday life. Like, I love you guys. You're wonderful. And for the people who are still supporting me through all of this craziness, who are still supporting me through very little videos and very little interaction and commenting, Thank you, but I really appreciate it because I honestly probably deserve to lose all of you because I have not been a good subscriber to you guys, so why should you be a good one to me? I hope you're having an awesome day and I really am excited to get back to YouTube. I just wanted to make this video just to be honest with you guys and let you know what I'm thinking, where I'm coming from, where I've been. Um, like I said, I haven't been reading a ton in the last few months, so my, my content coming back at the beginning might not be quite as bookish, and I'm really sorry if you don't like that. Um, let me know what you want me to do. Um, I will continue to start reading right now, and then I will make more booktube videos, obviously. This is a booktube channel, but, you know, there are a lot of other ideas I have and things I would like to do. Like, just let me know if you have anything you would like me to talk about or make a video about. I love you all. Bye!